everyone, I'm Elise Perry from the Australian Women's Cricket Team and today I thought I'd take you through my kit bag, um, which is probably not all that interesting um, besides all the normal uh, cricket gear, but um, I suppose you can have a look and you can judge for yourself. Uh, so on top I've just got my yellow cricket pads. Uh, we're currently playing a one day series against Sri Lanka, so um, these are the pads we're wearing. Next in the layer of stuff is uh, my playing hat and also the new and popular uh, yellow floppy hat which everyone's wearing and has been particularly handy over here in uh, hot sunny Sri Lanka. Thigh pad, so I normally wear a thigh pad with two bits of padding, one for the front and back leg um, at training and then during matches I tend to just wear a single thigh pad with the, the front leg thigh. Um, basically because it's a bit lighter and easier to run in, um, so running between wickets. Okay, next is my helmet, pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> um, I kind of tend to have a bit of a habit with most of my gear to hold on to it for as long as I possibly can. Um, I kind of like worn in things, so I've had this helmet for quite a while, so it's losing a bit of colour, but I sort of like that about it and it, it has a bit of a story to it, so that's my helmet. Probably the most important piece of equipment, my bat, uh, or bats, so I normally carry about three bats on tour, um, but tend to just use one, uh, especially if it's a good one and I'm sort of enjoying using it or it feels comfortable to, to play with. Uh, gloves is the next item, so I've got one, two, three, four pairs with me on tour at the moment. Um, again, I kind of like worn in things, so I'll probably use about two to three pairs of gloves, depending on how long the tour goes for. and. Um, often just use you know one pair at training and then or a couple of pairs at training and then a different pair for the match. Probably my favourite item in my kit bag is actually my first ever um, hat that I wore playing for Australia. So when I made my debut, and um, this is a hat that I was given, and um, I've sort of just kept it in my bag ever since. Um, we sort of tend, to, especially with limited overs cricket, we change hats often. You know the colours of our uniform changes a bit, and um, yeah. So to, to keep the first one. Um, that I ever got and it's sort of quite worn and old. Um, that's been really cool to have that and just kind of remind me of uh, when it all started. A few people asked uh, who the messiest person in the team is. Um, I think I'm reasonably tidy but uh, Meg Lenning is very good at commanding a lot of space in the change room with all her gear, it tends to spread everywhere. Um, as too is Elisa Healy and most particularly Holly Furling. Um, you tend to find her gear all over the change room. And she has a funny habit of also picking up a lot of other people's gear and accidentally putting it in her kit. So um, they're probably the messiest. Uh, in terms of superstitions, um, I like to put my right side of things on first. So I often put my right shoe on first, um, my right pad, my right glove. Um, yeah, I, I don't know why, I just sort of started as a habit and I've always done it. Um, besides that, I have a pretty old pair of socks um, that I tend to wear during matches. Um, but yeah, besides that, not too many other superstitions. So that's about all that's in my bag. Um, thanks very much for watching and, and also for your continued support of uh, the Australian Women's Cricket Team and, and Cricket Australia. Hopefully um, you're as excited about the summer as I am and um, all the best for your season coming up too.